Welcome to Just Learn Civil. In this tutorial, we will see how to calculate any data like mean temperature, precipitation, elevation, or any other based on zone using the function zonal statistics in UGIS. For example, suppose you want to find mean elevation district wise, then each district becomes zone and the calculated mean would be based on that zone only. If you have three zone, then you will get three different elevations, which are the mean within the zones. Let's see in this figure. Suppose this is a polygon, which is further divided into three more polygons, and these represent districts. So I name it one, two, and three districts. Now this is the DEM of the same polygon. All the lattice point that is the center point represents the elevation within this cell. Now, when you overlap this polygon with the DEM, you will get this output. Suppose yeah, you want to find the you want to find the elevation within zone one. Then, after overlapping the polygon. Polygon is zone and this is data. Now you want to find the data based on this zone. So what QGIS2 is in the journal statistics, it will delineate this zone based on the polygon. Something like this, which represents this zone and calculate the elevation, average elevation. So it will calculate the average of the elevation falling within this zone only, not others. You will get the data represented here. So all these elevations are calculated, then taken average and substituted here. In the similar manner, this data will be substituted in this file and so on. So this is how journal statistics work. Using journal statistics, you can using journal statistics, you can calculate how many populations are there in this zone. You can calculate average rainfall and so on. Let's see how to do this in OCIS. You can calculate not only mean but sum, count, maximum, standard deviation, minimum, maximum, etc. So, first you need to input polygon and DEM of the same location as shown in the figure earlier. This DEM, this polygon, and this DEM were of the same location. So that we can overlap remember the coordinates should be same as well otherwise they won't overlap i have prepared sample data this is the district one two three four five six 7, 8, and 10. There are 10 districts. Now I will import raster containing DEM of same location. Since the coordinates are same, location is same, both overlaps. It should overlap, otherwise, it cannot calculate zonal statistics. Now go to processing toolbar and search zonal statistics. Processing toolbar, then search for journal statistics. Double click to open. In the raster layer, you select the raster layer. Raster layer represents this DEM, which contains our data. Now, in the vector layer, this district is selected. Vector layer contains zone, DEM contains data. We need to calculate data based on zone. Now, in the output column prefix, enter any relevant word. Like you want to calculate this word will be attached to the attribute table. So, if you want to calculate the suppose area name is ABC, then you will get the data of ABC prefixed with this like sum underscore abc mean underscore abc count underscore abc and so on 
now what you want to calculate click if you want to calculate all then click all i want to calculate only mean or face i want to calculate mean sum and count Press ok three elements selected you can see here now press wrong Once your processing is completed, close the dial close this dialog box and check the output. You can check the output here. Open attributable. See we put we earlier put the prefix ABC, you get ABC count, ABC sum, ABC new. Now you can calculate for one. This is the sum, this is the count. Now, when you divide the sum by count, you will get the mean. Let's see. It's divided by. 228500 228500 you get 3435 you get the same data so this is how you can calculate the mean now there were 10 districts you get the edges of 10 districts that falls within the zone the zone being the district and the data being the DM. DM is digital elevation model but you can have any data like rainfall, population, temperature, anything and you can calculate based on the zone You can show in the level. ABC mean apply. Okay. Now you can see here you get the mean data. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, like, share, and comment if any further questions.